Hello, Bibliophile here. Today I decided to write a navigation script because KP7 on the forum said that he's working on one and having some difficulty. I took a look at his, and the fact that you had to write the HTML like this makes it very difficult. So let's try to get into this. To aid me in this, I've built a simple application that lets me open up a welcome message here. I can reload it. And if I go to my code editor and to user input, I can change something here, save the file, go back here, reload the page, and it's automatically changed. So let's get into it. And there you have it, a pretty simple navigation. Click on the page you want to go to, and it takes you there. We need to find the pages. Just has to have a nav page class, a visible class if you want it to be shown before they click on anything, a page attribute with the page name in it, and anything that you give a to-page attribute with the page name. When you click on it, it will take you to that page. As an example, I can use a to page equals test. Get rid of the href because we don't want to go anywhere and go to test page. Now, if we go back to the browser, I reload and we can click on here to go to the test page. JavaScript is pretty simple. All we have to do is look for old pages that are currently visible and go ahead and remove the visible so that they're hidden now. Now we have to find the page that we currently want to show. And if it's not found, just hide all the pages. And if it was found, then go ahead and add the visible attribute. This is the listener that we use to achieve this. So whenever the player clicks on anything, we just have to check for the event target, and that's the element that they clicked on. If there isn't one, then something weird happened, and we don't want to deal with it. But if there is one, and it has the to-page attribute, we want to show the page with that name. Thanks for watching.